upset or anything along those lines. And it's just like you, you don't realize that you're getting that upset. Or if you do, you don't really do anything about it. You just kind of get upset. It's like a my problem or my my solution is like a heart rate and blood pressure monitor thing that like helps you fix it. It, it. it tells you whenever it's too high and then helps you fix it. And mine is like the same as most others, but it, it tells you when it there it like it gives you solutions to fix that. And same thing with the blood pressure. Uh, so. I made a, my, my solution is just a, a, a program from scratch. I don't know how to actually code. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's there, I swear. <laughs> I swear it worked a second ago. <laughs> Go, can I try it again? I swear it, it just worked. <laughs> It was on scratch, so it doesn't actually like m measure it, but it like it, it's a prototype. It it, it generates a, a a number, and that acts as your blood pressure. And if it senses that it's over a certain threshold, it tells you and gives you solutions to fix that. So, human geo. It relates to population and migration. That's yeah, because seventy seven point nine million Americans. This is just America are affected by high blood pressure. One out of every three people has high blood pressure, and it kills. In 2014 alone, it killed 410,000 people in America. And UK is only about 12 million, but um, half of all heart attacks are caused by having high blood pressure. That, that's just like population. So this is just me talking about my research paper. Um, you didn't capitalize eyes. <laughs> it, it was just the research paper that I talked about. Chemistry. I did a thing for chemistry. I did do that. This one works. all the teaks that mine hits. <laughs> um, and my algebra graph, is, it shows population by age 20 to 34, 35 to 44, so on and so forth, um, and the percent of that population that has high blood pressure, so 9% of uh, 20 to 34 year olds all the way up to 72% of 75 years, or 75 year olds and older. 